Uh, morning. Today I'm going to start a little tutorial on JavaScript 101 and Cordova. Um, first of all, we need to start a project. Um, so we're going to get to the folder and open up a terminal and from there uh, create a new project create um, what do I call it um, well, it's quite some um, ID contains reserve word. Hmm? Oh. There's your bugger. Okay. Okay, we've created it, or the folder. If I show you, create, Cordova create sample is the name of the folder and obviously that's the name of your project so as you say there's the folder um, cd sample or ls and there's all the stuff um, platforms called over platforms add uh, android android Okay, brilliant. Okay, I'm going to use um, Genimation for this, um, which is all set up and running to save a bit of time. Um, so from this, since I've got no other emulators running or the phone is not plugged in, I just need Cordova Run, and that should push it over to the um, Genimation. Um, takes a bit of time. Uh, now I just want to do this at the beginning just to see what we get from the very offset um, before I dive into um, editing it. Come on. Okay, launch success. Okay, there we go. There's our standard Cordova application. In fact, I can actually make that a little bit bigger, can I? Oh, a little broader. Oh, there really matters. Okay, so my advice to anyone is never use NetBeans. It's a piece of shit as far as I'm concerned. Um, what I use at the moment is Visual Studio Code which is uh, a recent thing for me um, before that I was using Sublime Text but you could use Notepad++ I think if you're on Windows um, or several you can use to be honest with you so we'll fire it up um, we just need to get our folder which is desktop uh, Okay, and there's the sample project. Drag it over and drop it. Okay, so we close down that. You can see our little Cordova wrap thing running there. So basically, we just need to go to www index HTML, and this is the standard as this. Um, basically it's Apache Cordova um, the ID device ready it blinks as you say you're blinking um, and it's got an event listening connected to the device an event received connecting to the device um, and there is your Cordova JS um, index so if we look at the JS now 
I don't know where my index has gone. Ah, yeah. If we look at the JS for it, this is just a standard template. Um, basically, when JavaScript goes through, it comes to this line, and this is the first line, and it says do that. Um, basically, we're, we're not interested in changing any of this lot. Um, however. If we were to change that to an alert message and then just from the shell, simple as that, we just run it again. Um. Okay, it's a bit quicker this time. Dun, dun, dun. All right, there it is. Okay, received event device ready. Okay, so that is the ID of device ready. So now we know we're up and running. Simple as that. Um, oh, 